are signs Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to get you some important messages that you need to hear today. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me for your signs Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. What does their person, their love interest want out of this uh, love connection? Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person whom you could be thinking about or dealing with right now. I'll take this one. The star. Okay. I'm going to start with, for those of you, if you are broken up with this person going through or going through some issues right now, the star indicates this person wanting to heal this connection, okay? And Nine of Swords, they have, they're worrying in regards of the future. Ten of Pentacles and the Hangman feels like some of you, maybe you could be taking a break or could be separated. But the Hangman here can indicate them needing, needing time to think. But also, the hangman can indicate some sort of a sacrifice. So, um, this person you have in mind, your love interest, may need time to think about what they truly want. And it may not always mean that, you know, Ten of Pentacles um, could also be, yes, of course, we're asking about what do they want out of this connection. Maybe they do want um, a permanent um, connection with you, marriage, but they're thinking about it, okay? So, but they may also have other issues. They could be thinking about work, money, home situation. Hmm. So your person actually is worrying, stressing out. But with, because right next to it is the temperance and welfare. So they're kind of out of whack right now trying to figure something out, right? Mm. Nine of Cups can indicate. Uh, actually, I feel like your person in mind, your love interest, could be thinking whether, whether they'd be better off being single alone, doing things all by themselves, or to actually share it with you especially if they have some money issues or family issues home situation going on that they could be worrying about but i feel like nana cups also can indicate that you are actually what they want right uh, you are their wish fulfillment here and they really want this future with you but i feel like there are other external factors or could be internal factors internal factors uh, maybe an indication of some emotional issues, mental issues. Again, there are blockages here, right? Uh, obviously, that's why Nine of Swords, they're, they're thinking a lot and they're worrying a lot. And external factors could be because of money, could be because of somebody else. Anything else that's going on in their life, career. And then we've got the Queen of Swords here in our first. Your person in mind could be an Aries, could be um, a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, somebody like you are, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, again, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, can be any sign, okay? It feels like, yeah, there is a contemplation here because the Nine of Cups is in the middle of the Ten of Pentacles and the Emperor in reverse. The Emperor indicates responsibilities someone more mature but the page of cups here is in love is somebody much younger so i feel like right now at this moment are signs your love interest or your person in mind right now may actually contem may actually be contemplating whether 
whether they want to be single and you know when they do whatever they want nine of cups here like this is an indulging energy right without you in your life again they can do whatever they want you know the emperor in reverse they have one less responsibility or pressure that's what i'm getting here they won't have any pressure and thinking about the future or working for the future it's like a huge responsibility right ten of pentacles and the emperor in reverse i feel at this moment maybe they just want to see how things go between the two of you also maybe because they know you are the queen of swords and it's in reverse right now if both of you are separated going through some issues they they actually know what you want um maybe either you have told them directly or indirectly so they know what you want and they're not 100 percent sure if they can give you exactly what you want so maybe they need time to see first with the two of swords here in love first and decide if they could give you this nine of pentacles i think they're moving slowly because nine of pentacles is a very slow energy they want to see if it is worth it they may feel a sense of pressure to give you what you want or to fully commit or to reconcile but deep down with the star here and the nine of cups these two cards indicates wish fulfillment so deep down they know you're the one you're the one that they want you're the one that they want to you know work on this connection they would like to work on um that they actually do see a future with you but in the meantime i sense them just thinking also that if they if they were to do things on your own again like there is less pressure right because the queen of swords can be also someone whom you know has yeah, I'll, maybe they have maybe they think you you've got st some standards um you have your boundaries or that you may be a little bit strict a little bit stern so they're kind of afraid that if they could live up to your standards give you exactly what you want so there's a lot of pressure here so they could be thinking whether they should actually completely invest in you in this connection or just invest in themselves with the nine of cups here but let's see more air signs this could actually i feel like this could actually apply to someone new someone you could be currently seeing or connected with or about to embark in a relationship a new relationship so I feel like they're just taking things slow. I do sense them if they really would like to commit fully or to reconcile with you. They would take things slowly, okay? The intention I feel like is good, is sincere. Because they definitely see a future with you. Three of Wands, yes, and Robert is Ten of Swords and Robert. Again, for those of you separated, going through some issues right now, they definitely like to heal this connection. Some of them, it is them um, wanting either you to turn your back on the third party or them turning back on the third party. Also, I'm sensing them, again, giving time, wanting time, and not wanting to be hasty. Because, again, the Nine of Pentacles here to in making a decision to commit or to get back together if both of you are separated king of swords and lovers page of swords and lovers and we've got the justice here see the intention and what they really want from this connection is to commit is to be serious but they're still sussing things out page of swords and lovers It's almost like I know deep down that this is this connection is gonna become really serious or that I want it to become a serious connection. 
but they may be again sussing things out they may not be 100 percent clear right now what they see how they feel is that you you're someone potentially they could commit to but they definitely want to take some time to ponder with that idea take some time to be 100 percent sure that this is what they want or that this connection is stable and that they really can see it's like they want to see more that's what i'm getting here and the queen and the king here both are in reverse this may be an indication of maybe both of you for those of you if you're not speaking with this person right now they are in the midst of deciding justice but this decision is very important to them they're serious and ultimately again with the star here the ten of pentacles and nine of cups you are the one that they want to be with definitely have their eyes on you on this connection and i don't see them really playing around or just want to hurt you um But at the same time, they could be in that selfish mood as well, Nine of Cups. Where they still want to do whatever they want to do while they're single. Or if, if they're still single or if, if they're thinking about becoming single, right? It feels like a transition here, right, Earth Signs? And for some of you, if this is someone, again, kind of new, embarking to a new relationship, they're not sure if they can give up on their singlehood right now. Because being single, it feels like, you know, Nine of Cups, they can do whatever they want to. They have the freedom to do whatever they want to. And without having to, without having to think about pleasing you or if they're going to make you mad, if they, if they do something that is more like their own interest here okay individual interest nine of cups five of swords here and one first yeah if you're separated they would like to end the conflict um and potentially heal this connection potentially reconcile then and serious take the relationship to the next level justice here marriage i see marriage justice and the ten of pentacles you're thinking about it you're thinking about it and this part of the reading, I feel like could apply to any situation, like a, an ex or someone you you are separated from, going through some issues with, or someone completely new. But whatever I'm seeing here, uh, as signs, is that ultimately they want something serious with you. They want a future with you. But obviously, there are a lot of um, a lot of factors that could be making them move in a little bit slower um, I don't see them wanting to be hasty I don't see them wanting to play games either if I was sold to love first alright earth signs Virgo Taurus Capricorn this is your reading hope you resonated in some way shape or form if you did please hit like share and subscribe I am open for personal readings if you'd like to book me my information is in the description box below I will leave you with uh, two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. Second playlist is from this channel. has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics and different questions. Check it out if you want to. And also, um, yeah, for those of you who like to be notified every time when I post your videos, don't forget to hit on the bell notification button. See you uh, again tomorrow. Hopefully, take care. Our science.